What's going on, guys and gals? <laughs> my name is William Clark, and welcome to a video. So this has been on my mind for quite a while. I didn't really think about making a video until just now. Ah, but it's actually been for a couple of years. This is what I've been wanting to talk about for a while. So ever since... I started using profanity in my fucking videos, ha, huh? fuck, <laughs> yeah, I've had people attack me on YouTube, I've had people attack me on my Facebook, on my Messenger, even on my Instagram, people are saying, even to this day, Stuff like, holy shit, you're swearing, think about the children, oh my god, kids might be watching this video, don't swear, quit using profanity, you bastard, and much more to that subject, the thing is, first of all, it's my channel, I can say whatever the fuck I want, if I'm gonna be using profanity, I'm gonna be using goddamn profanity. I don't care what anybody else says. I'm not doing this censor shit. Shit! And I'm not going to censor myself just because some stupid little kids decide to complain or have some stupid parents complain about my videos. I mean, first of all, grow the fuck up, okay? That's the first thing. Grow the fuck up. It's not like your kids are going to be, you know, are going to be free from cursing. They're going to go to middle school and high school hearing this everywhere they go. Once they get older, if they ever go to prison or jail, they're going to hear that. You know, you can't, you can't, you know, protect them from this kind of stuff. They will hear it one way or another. And, you know, this generation, kids these days, and even adults alike, they all have one of these. They all have a smartphone. Either that or a tablet, or a computer, or a game system that can connect to Wi-Fi and Internet. And all these things, it, there's, there's, there's a, a little tiny, tiny little uh, thing you might not have heard of called YouTube. Yeah, if you're watching this video, it's on fucking YouTube. Okay, so a lot of videos on YouTube are going to be full of profanity. I mean, also, you can't trust kids to stay on, you know, whatever, like, My Little Pony videos or whatever. Because, the thing is, most of the time, they're just going to let things run. They're going to be like, oh yeah, My Little Pony, My Little Pony, My Little Pony, and all of a sudden, somehow... Some way they're watching a PewDiePie video. Somehow, some way they're watching the angry video game nerd, and he is full of profanity. So the thing is, that's the that's first thing. Grow the fuck up. Kids will hear it either way. Second thing is, okay, shut the fuck up. My videos are my videos. I'm not going to change my videos just because people complain about profanity. All right. Deal with it. Just fucking deal with it. And third of all, why the hell is this shit an issue? These are just words. Yeah, they're bad words and profanity and all that good shit. But at least I'm not being racist in my videos. Huh. First of all, again, like I said, these are just words. Shit, damn, bitch, cunt, vagina whistle. These are all just words. Whether you like it or not. Yeah, again, they're bad words, but they're words nonetheless. So if you people are going to be pissed off just for me using words and, and talking in my videos, you're, you're just pathetic, okay? It's just bullshit and crazy that there are some people that will go after the YouTube channel 
that he's using instead of profanity. Okay, so I watch a lot of Cinemaster. Yeah, you know, I watch a lot of Angry Video Game Nerd and James and Mike Mondays. I watch that constant. I watch PewDiePie, Jacksepticeye, Markiplier. I watch those people. They have a lot of profanity in them. I mean, yeah, Markiplier and Jacksepticeye doesn't have much profanity as opposed to, like, like I said, some massacre. But they have profanity nonetheless. I don't see people going after them because of that. Also, it's your fault as a parent or grandparent or aunt or uncle or niece, nephew, whatever. I don't even fucking know. If you have a kid or a grandkid or whatever that's watching YouTube, it's your fault if they hear a bad word. I, I understand, you know, you may not know about this YouTuber they're watching, and you may think, oh, they're kid-friendly, they're not going to use profanity. That's fine. But, okay, so, after the first profane word you hear, like, let's say someone says fuck, that would be your responsibility to either take the phone away or tablet or whatever and search for something better. But, no. They keep on watching. So, inevitably, they're going to be hearing, fuck, fuck, shit, damn, bitch, uh, ass dong, vagina butt whistles, shit, tongue of fucks. They're going to be hearing this kind of stuff. And, you know, it pisses me off, okay? It really fucking does. It pisses me off because, first and foremost, like I stated before, it's my channel. If I'm going to be using profanity, I'm going to. That doesn't make me a bad person. It just makes you look very childish for, I mean, yeah, as I heard a lot of people say, using profanity makes you childish and whatever. But I don't give a shit, okay? You people are more childish because you decide to complain to the YouTuber that is saying these things and doing these things. You are basically complaining to these YouTubers, hey, you're using profanity. Okay, first of all, what if that's part of their character or persona? What if that is a part of their channel? You know, it's in a masker, angry video game nerd. He uses profanity all the time in his, you know, angry video game nerd series and James and Mike Mondays. So, and, and that's part of his character. You know, he gets pissed off over video games that are shit. And, um, yeah. So, first of all, that could be a part of their character or a part of their persona. Or it's just how they decide to run things. If you're going to be a fucking pathetic wuss, yeah, a fucking wussy in the pussy, and decide, oh, hey, you know what, you're, you're using profanity. Fuck you. Oh, 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 that, that brings me to another convenient point. Some people, they tell you not to use profanity in their comments, and then they use profanity in the comments. Like, hey, don't use profanity, you fuckwad. Yeah, if you don't want me pro using profanity, either get the fuck off my channel, or just deal with it. Another thing is if you don't if you don't like people using profanity, why are you using it in your comments? That contradicts everything. You know, by saying fuckwad or asshole or bitch Jesus or some shit like that, I don't know. <laughs> Jesus bitch or some whatever. You contradict yourself when you say you don't like when people use profanity or tell people not to use it. Oh, uh, you people are just fucking ridiculous. Okay, I'm... Yeah. And again, those of these people are... They attack me on my social media, you know, not just my YouTube, which I just... I just get rid of the comments because I'm like, yeah, fuck you. It's my channel. I do what I want. I say what I want. Another thing is... You know, my Facebook and Messenger. On Facebook, I block stuff, as, as well as on Messenger. 
you know, because I'm like, okay, so first of all, if someone message me, messages me on my Messenger account, and they say that kind of stuff, you know, it's like, uh, don't use profanity, dumbass, or whatever, I'm going to be like, um, no, first of all, it's my channel, fucking deal with it, or get the fuck out, and it's like, lock them. Because, most likely, that's going to lead to some bullshit. That's going to lead to arguments and whatever. So I don't want to deal with that shit. I've shut that shit down. No exceptions. Also, kids are going to be playing... You know, these are the same people that are playing Call of Duty, playing Grand Theft Auto V, 4, uh, San Andreas, Vice City... Playing all these games that have a lot of profanity in them. Playing, uh, well, Halo has just a little bit, not as much as Call of Duty. But it still has profanity on, on the West. And all these things, all these games that kids these days are playing have the most and worst profanity in the world. Not just because of the game, but because of the community. You know, when your kid gets either a headset or even if they don't have one. They go on multiplayer on a Call of Duty server or any other server, and they will get fucking cursed at. Like, you hear people cursing up a fucking storm here. And not to mention, they're also being racist as well. The majority of the times I go onto a Call of Duty server and play multiplayer or multiplayer zombies, you know, like a two or three player match, you know, me and two other people or one other person, or three other people, or whatever. I all the time hear profanity coming from the other end, you know, where these people live. I also hear a lot of uh, racist things. And you know what? I deal with it. Because I know I use these words too. Not necessarily racist words, but I use profanity a lot. So I myself would be a contradictor if that's not if that's not a word, it is now because I just fucking said it. Bitch. I would have contradicted myself, be like, okay, please don't use profanity, and when I myself use profanity. Remember when I say that people comment on other people's videos or even mine, and say, don't use profanity, dumbass or whatever. That's a big contradicting thing. That's the most contradicting statement I've ever heard. And so I'm watching this YouTuber called um, Hoodie Hoodlum's Revenge or something like that. Someone like that who does Scooby Pops videos. And he makes this same complaint. You know, and a lot of people are saying, but don't you care about the children? No, I fucking don't care about children. If they are going to watch my videos, they're going to have to fucking deal with it. And also, this is a part of why I decided to put as, like, about me, I am not kid-friendly or family-friendly, but fuck it. Because I've had, I've had enough bullshit. I have, I've had enough of people saying, you know, about this kind of stuff. Another thing is that these people, even though I post that on my about page, it still doesn't do anything. These people are still fucking me. Left and right. They're still saying, you know, don't use profanity, bitch. Think about the children. Yeah, okay. First of all, you know what the fuck you were going into when I say this is not family friendly. And I said fuck it. So you people need to grow the fuck up or shut the fuck up. And I highly recommend you shut the fuck up. Because, first of all, first and foremost, again, this is my channel. I am who I am. I'm not going to stop using profanity. This is who I am. Deal with it. Second of all, you people are just pussies, okay? What are you going to do? Complain to YouTube about profanity? Yeah. You go ahead and fucking do that. I don't give a shit. When there's several other channels out there that do the same thing, use the same profanity, use the same vulgar language that I'm using, to a more massive extent, 
Yeah. There's more profanity channels out there than anything. And like I said, PewDiePie, Jacksepticeye, Markiplier, Cinemasker, all these people that I watch, they have profanity. Even this guy, Hoodie Hoodlum's Revenge. This video, he's fucking up a storm. <laughs> he's like, I'm not gonna fucking censor myself because some fucking little kids for blah, 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 blah. You know, that's exactly how I feel right now. Because I'm done with people basically trying to control me and trying to get me to use censorship. I'm not doing that. I ain't doing that. No fucking way in Satan's ass crack am I fucking doing that. Now, I understand if I was being a racist and saying all these words that, that are racist towards certain people are racist. Then I can understand why you people would be pissed. Alright, I understand that. But, to just say the word fuck, ass, bitch, damn, whatever, shit. Or any combination like fucking fuckers, or fuck ton of farts, or, uh... Bitch nuggets, salami fuck. <laughs> That's something. But <laughs> yeah, I'm I'm just I am laughing right now, not just because it said bitch salami something fuck, but uh salami fuck. But also because. I can't believe how stupid these people are to think that just because they are going to be saying, you know, don't do this, don't do that, because think of the children. Well, you know what I got to say about that? Fuck the children. I don't give a fuck about little kids. I don't give a fuck about tweens or teenagers or whatever. I am not here to please people. I'm here to make content. Right? So I know you can't please everybody on the internet. But I can't fucking... I can't let this go without making a video about it. Multiple people, not just myself, have had this issue. And I think it's time to fucking Stop. Stop commenting this kind of stuff. These people will not change. I won't change. Just because you say something like, stop using profanity, stop, you know, using vulgar language, think about the children or whatever, I'm not going to stop, all right? I, uh, and like I said before, I don't care about the children. I don't give a fuck if your child is like two or three and learning how to use a keyboard, whatever, or a 17, 18-year-old kid. I don't care about them. I don't care if they hear vulgar language or not, right? Also, you people that are complaining, first and foremost, you people might be saying that same shit. What if you and your boyfriend or girlfriend or husband or wife or whatever are having an argument? Most of the time, it ain't going to be like, oh, you didn't take out the trash or whatever. No, it's going to be like, fuck you, you piece of fucking shit. You didn't fucking take out the fucking trash or blah, blah, blah. You stole my penis. Whatever. You know, and, and you know, you wonder why kids pick this shit up. It's probably mostly because of you. Yeah, it's because some, they watch profanity on YouTube and listen to that shit. But it's mostly because of you as well. You know, you're fighting with your significant other, your boyfriend, girlfriend, husband, wife. You're fighting with your goddamn fucking dog. You're yelling at them. You're, you're doing shit. Or hell, you're yelling at your fucking kid. And you're like, you bitch, pick that shit up. I'll fuck you to death or some weird shit like that. And I'm like, okay, first and foremost, they're complaining to me about using profanity when you yourself are using the same profanity that you're telling me not to use. Again, fucking contra-fucking diction. I'm done with this shit. I'm tired of people, left and right, 
doing this. You know what I gotta say? Deal with it. Just deal with it. Again, I'm not gonna fucking change who I am. I'm not gonna change the content of my channel, you know, from being non-kid friendly to all of a sudden, I'm the most kid friendly channel in the universe. I'm not going to do that. In other words, I'm not going to bow down to you fuckwads just because you think that commenting these things are going to make me change. No. I don't change. And I won't. I'm not going to let you people that are commenting these sort of things that are contradicting bullshit or that make you look like a fucking moron or whatever. I'm not going to let you dictate how I run my channel. Emphasis on the words I and my. This is not your channel. If you wanted a kid-friendly channel, make your fucking own. Make your own kid-friendly channel. Make your own family-friendly channel. If you are so worried about, you know, kids picking up these bad words or whatever, first of all, you should be focused more on what your kids are doing more than anything. You should be, you know, monitoring what they're watching, first of all. Second of all, limit the time they're watching YouTube. And, and third of all, grow the fuck up. Admit to your mistakes. Own up to that shit. Tell people, yeah, I'm the one, you know, yeah, I yell at my husband or wife or boyfriend or girlfriend and I use a lot of profanity. I'm sorry for that. You know, whatever. Own up to that shit. Don't just act like you have never used a goddamn bad life in your fucking life, okay? Also, don't act like you're perfect. Don't act like you're this god among men or women. You're not. You're just a scrub. Like I am. But, at least I am proving points. You don't have any points being made or to be made. So fuck off or deal with it. Grow the fuck up. Or shut the fuck up. And like I said before, I highly recommend you shut the fuck up. Because I am done with people dictating my uh, how I run my channel. This is my channel for a reason. Alright? First of all, fuck off. Or grow up. Your kid will hear these words, whether you like it or not. These kids... Whether it be YouTube, going into elementary and middle school, or high school, or college, you know, or maybe it's you having a relationship issue with your significant other or whatever, or you stub your toe on a dead body or some weird shit, I don't know, you'd be that fucked up, I guess, if you're already complaining about people using profanity when you yourself are. You'd be saying, you saying fuck too, you know? Everybody says fuck. And I am so sick and so tired of your people's bullshit. It's time to grow the fuck up. You can't monitor your kids from, and you can't really stop your kids from hearing these words. Yeah, you can stop, you know, stop. YouTube and you know, these apps and whatever, these video games that they're playing, but they will always find a way, whether you like it or not. Once you get your ass to high school, you're going to be hearing that more than anything. Most of what I heard in high school was fuck, shit, damn, bitch, and all these other sort of bad words that you supposedly are pissed off about. So what, if your kid yells and sees and says bad words at a high school or college or whatever, are you going to walk up to that school and be like, shut this shit down, shut the whole fucking school down, 
because one kid used profanity. Oh my god. I you people I feel like that's what's going to happen. Some people are gonna get so pissed off about one or two students using profanity that you're going to want to shut the whole school down. Because you're dumb enough to basically let this bother you. First of all, they're high schoolers. It you know, they say worse things than what you could possibly imagine. It's high school. They're going to learn these bad words, whether or not they've already learned them. I'm done with people messaging me on my messenger, talking to me on Facebook and, and Twitter, Instagram, YouTube, and the list goes on, all the social media sites that I'm on. I'm tired of people saying <clears throat> to stop using profanity. Because that's not going to happen. I will not stop using profanity. I won't fucking stop. And in case I have not said fuck or profanity yet in this video, which I most certainly have, you, you know this shit. Fuck! Fuck, 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 fuck. Fucking fuckers fucked up. Fuck. There you go. That's your profanity for the fucking day. <laughs> Anyways, guys and gals, if you fucking <laughs> like this video, please give this video a fucking like. If not, that's fine too. Don't forget to fucking comment down below your thoughts on the whole thing. But if you comment down below, make sure it's not about this. Like, it's not about. You know, oh my god, using profanity, oh, shut that shit down, turn this, turn this kid to the authorities, turn this, uh, 18 year old motherfucker into the authorities for using bad words, oh my god, you don't run this country, okay, you just don't, you can't have authority over a person's YouTube channel, you just can't, you can't, okay, you really can't. Whether or not you like it, you just can't. You have to fucking deal with whatever it is they're doing. Fuckers! Anyways, don't forget to fucking subscribe and click that bell icon down below to get notified of my future uploads and live streams. And as always, holy fucking shit! Okay. And as always, I will see you in the next fucking video. Peace out, people! Hey! Bro, huh, bitches?